Hey, Terry Brazil here for PerfectElectronicCigarette.com. Today we're going to go and take a look at a variety of different flavors of e-juice that I got from TrueVapor.com. Um, they went and sent me over a bunch of samples. I believe that yours will come in 30 milliliter versus 10, so it's going to actually have a label on it. Look a little bit prettier than mine. But uh, I'm going to actually do these one by one. All these liquids I actually got at 12 milligram and 18 milligram they're a little bit strong for my taste I like to go and use 8 milligram generally but in this case I'm going to go and actually use these the way they are and myself I go and cut them with uh, some VG it gives them a little bit more it brings a flavor out I guess you can say and gives them a, a lot more vapor but uh for all these uh, e-juice reviews or e-liquid reviews whatever you wish to call it that I'm going to do for True Vapor, I'm going to be using the Titan 510 manual just because I think it puts off uh, the best vapor, gives you the best hit. Now usually I actually go and use stuff for 2-3 weeks and then do my reviews, which I did do for this liquid. But um, for now on, with my liquid reviews, I'm just going to do them on the spot, first impression type of thing. In this review, we're going to be checking out the apple flavored e liquid from True Vapor. Now, this is 12 milligrams, not as strong as the 18 milligram uh, friends of his that I was reviewing. Um, I, like I said, I've been using this stuff for a while. I'm going to go and drop a couple drops inside the cart here. Maybe a little tiny dab on the atomizer. And let me go ahead and cook this and we'll give her a shot here. It gives off some pretty good vapor. It's uh, kind of like what you'd get from any kind of electronic cigarette out of the box. The apple's sort of like the peach. It's really faint. You never really get much of a really crisp, strong apple taste with any of them that I've tried, at least. But uh, the apple's a lot like the cherry, or a lot like the peach. It's kind of sharp but faint aftertaste um i like, really like mixing the apple with the chocolate and after you um, put a little vg or something in it it actually brings it out more i would i think um but all in all it's pretty good tasting liquid and i've used quite well not quite a bit of it but at least four or five carts of it but, but it tastes pretty good and uh i think all around it's a really good liquid especially for mixing the True Vapor liquids that I've tested out are really good. Um, I really kind of, there's some liquids out there I don't like as good as the factory stuff, and this is pretty much seems like what you would go and get out of the factory with the exception of RY4 Juicy Fruit. Okay, but um, all in all, if I had to go and rate True Vapor on a scale of one being, you know, completely horrible, screwed up my order that never got to me after they kicked my dog and a 10 being that it was the greatest stuff made of gold cost absolutely nothing and was delivered to my door by strippers then I'd probably go and say that they are roughly about an 8 um, you'll probably never see me give anything a 10 but they're roughly about an 8 they have some really good uh, liquid they have good prices they're not the lowest prices they're not the best liquid but they're they're right there in the higher part of the middle um, all in all, I recommend that you go and uh, check out True Vapor for yourself and see how you like them. If you'd like to learn more about electronic cigarettes, watch other various how-to videos, reviews, visit us on our forums, other various things, there's going to be a link up here somewhere. Just go ahead and click on that and come check us out, and we have a lot to offer. You have a great day.